guys, it's Danica and welcome back to my channel. To those who are new to my channel, welcome. My name is Danica. I'm a registered nurse in the Philippines and also here in the UK. If you're new here on this channel, then I encourage you to click on the subscribe button below and also the bell button beside it so that you will be notified every time that we have an update. So guys, for today's video, the relocation <laughs> continues. As you can see, I'm in a different room now, so I'm actually in Truro now. Um, so actually, let me just show you. So, this is the room I've got. There's still lots of, you know, things around there. It's still not super sorted out. But that's what I'm gonna do after I record this video. So actually, guys, I am living with Marcus' family here in Truro for a while. And then, we'll see if I could get a place as well. But yeah, so relocation. So actually, guys, after my last day, like the next day, that night, that's when we actually moved. So Marcus' family helped me move. Um, his dad drove a truck. We rented a truck here. And if you're wondering how much was it, I think the rent of the van itself depends, of course, about the size. But um, I think around 100, 100 pounds, and then maybe around... I don't know how much was the gasoline, but you will shoulder that as well, maybe. But Marcus said it all comes to a total of around 200 pounds. But you need to also um, have a deposit of 300 pounds for that. So yeah, I think we were able to um, get everything in the flat for like an hour. The thing is that it's supposed to be like the next day, like Saturday. But they decided nighttime because the area I am actually is not very good. Like it's highway, so you're really gonna be obstructing the traffic if we do it daytime. So that's why it was nighttime. And then we just walk and then went to the train station and took took the train because in the van there's just three people actually in the front. So there's four of us, including his brother. So like <laughs> we're not all gonna fit in. So we just took the train going back here actually. And then the next day, I actually went back again because uh, my friends are having like um you know a party for me, a small gathering before you know I transfer here. So it was a nice time actually. We just ate and then watched a movie and then I came back here again by train. So yeah, that's been like here and there for the past like two days actually. And then yesterday was the only time I was actually able to organize our stuff. Hi everyone! Well, this is amazing! I'm actually the only person here in the tour station. Gosh! So if you're wondering, I just actually came back today because my friends are having like a party for me. So I'm just waiting for a patron, but there's literally no one. Wow! It's so weird. <laughs> so, yes! I'm just gonna wait for my train. It's actually gonna be in like 20, 26 minutes, so I have lots of time. But yeah, it's still quite cold. So, yes, this has been like my first day being unemployed basically. So, yeah, it's gonna be interesting. <laughs> Um, this is quite the big room actually. This is a front room here. Um, it fits most of the stuff actually, but I still need like sorting out so it's not like as messy as it is. I'm trying to sell um, a bit of our stuff in a um, marketplace, but otherwise um, it's okay. <laughs> so still, you know, trying to figure out um, stuff here around the room. I am actually familiar here in Truro already because, you know, this is where Mark's family is. So I was here like a few times before. And where I live is just really like near the town center. It's just walk, like two minutes walk and then that's it. And if I'm going to the hospital actually, it just takes seven minutes by bus. But it's too far to walk. If I could, you can, maybe I can, but that's like 30 to 35 minutes. Depends on, you know, how fast I actually would walk. But yeah, and then today I just went to TK Maxx and we'll get to buy just a few things actually. Um, you know, what else can be done in this um in this room? But yeah, that's the plan. Um I have I actually I actually have like this two week gap, but at the moment I just I don't really feel like I'm not you know, I'm not super relaxed because I'm, I'm sorting lots of things. Actually, there's a lot of things that's gonna be happening. Tomorrow, we're gonna come back for the end of tenancy cleaning. And then again, I've mentioned this in my previous vlog, I paid like 200 pounds for that. 
and then on March 1st, what am I gonna do on March 1st? Yeah, all right, yeah, I booked for like a hair call or something, you know, for a change, you know, because I'm changing place, so I'm not gonna cut my hair, but like a new hair color, you know, it will be interesting. And then after that, March 2, I actually have my theory test for driving, so yes i'll tell you guys more about that if you want um i'll make a particular vlog about it and hopefully I actually pass the theory test so that's the first step before you can actually have your you know practical test driving so yeah who what else am i gonna say actually so this is just you know an update what's happening now and i'm gonna put here as well some clips um on what their town center looks like here in churu i'd say it's more lively than actually in turkey because um i don't know just most of the shops are closing but here i really love that there's starbucks there's cafe nero there's like local coffee shops that are really good and got like bigger tk max it's just a better you know better town center i'd say i couldn't really feel yet that i'm super free that because i've as i've told you i have lots of things to do and like telling you know the gas electricity that i'm moving out and stuff like that so there's lots to be sorted out maybe if i finish all of that in the in this like first week so you know i'm free and like the next week before i actually begin on you know the third week of march that would be great i actually have like a virtual induction on march 13 so i don't need to like go in there yet and then the next day that's when i'm gonna start to work i couldn't feel it yet because at the moment my mind is you know in sorting here my theory tests and those things so once it's all sorted maybe i can finally you know try to be nervous <laughs> about you know my job but i think i'll be all right because then you know it's not like something i am unfamiliar with right because i've worked in the same department so you know hopefully um it's most likely like the same although i haven't really had a pick of you know the unit and stuff but maybe i'll go there one day just to see how long it takes for me to go to the bus and then you know find where my department is because yeah they start quite earlier they're half seven in my previous job it was 8 a.m so good luck to me <laughs> but yeah it's gonna be interesting so lots of things happening and yeah so hopefully you join me in this journey we'll be in here together but yes for now that's my update and yes <laughs> thank you guys for watching this video and i hope you enjoy and see you again in my next one